devastation is enormous. You must have been freaking out. I once went through there on a pilgrimage to Puri, and I missed my connection twice. And you didn't speak Bengali? Oh, I didn't even know I was called that. How long were you on the train? A couple of days. A couple of days. So what was your hometown again? Ganesh away. I must have had it wrong, because it doesn't exist. But there must be something else that you do remember. The platform I fell asleep on had this big rain tank. And it was only a few stops from Ganesh away. Oh, there are thousands of sessions with rain tanks. Look, it was a, a long time ago. Have you heard of this new program, Google Earth? Ah. It's incredible. You can find any place from anywhere. Listen to me. We can find out how fast passenger trains went back then. We take that speed, multiply it by the hours that you are on the train. That's it. We create a search radius. And inside there, you'll find the station with a rain tank. Yeah, but it would take a lifetime to search all the stations in India. Chup. Did I say all the stations? Buddhu. Okay, even half the stations. Really, guys, I, I don't want to talk about this. Did your parents try to find you? Once they tried to find him. No, I just mean like, you know, if they tried to find him, maybe they left like a paper trail or something. What paper trail? I didn't know his son. My mom couldn't read or write. What did she do? A laborer. She carried rocks. Your mom? Yeah. Just... My mom died about uh, four years ago now. I'm sorry. My dad is just still so angry at her. I mean, not for getting sick, obviously, but just for refusing chemo. But she just knew herself, you know? She knew what her terms were, and she knew how she wanted to live, so... I just couldn't accept that, I guess. How do you feel? Mm, I just miss her. What do you think of Bharat's search radius idea?